Uh, it's smaller now I'm finalizing 2018 look digital library so I'm trying to finish them up so my people can use all the time same thing which is my tooth library right so this is my first smaller I like the occlusion table irregular I like the um, central, group. central group dissection group and the whole cusp is different and whenever you see height of contour I like that I like the broad white contacts in order to add it so this this will be like this is better so this is higher than mingle cusp so I have to let Josh know because then I can get rid of the whole the excursion interference so anyway this is finalizing about the the tooth contour and then I can send it to the Josh then he can make the final so this is molar the first molar now this is second molar same things I'm trying to make the nice occlusion table which is the square types however I can make the good cusp like that so here so you can see I have to set up the first if I said this is measures measures slightly major cusp slightly bigger than this too. same thing I want the broad wide contact okay so this height cusp tip is higher than the lingual cusp I like the dissection group, so I try to make the natural tooth morphology. And the second I move to the other side, created all marginal ridge. Right? And then I cusp. And this is pretty much done. So I make the another group. Make just a little tiny bit. That's good. So when you see the same thing, see the regulation between the two, so you know what, I put a little bit more higher, okay, then it's better than higher than the other side, side view, mm -hmm. cruise view, lingual view, distal view, I cut it just a little gently, and then I make the cusp line to make, yes. That's good, right? Yeah. This second. This is first lower molar, same things. As a lot of technicians do, do not know the major cusp is almost just like V-shape. Do not make the square one just like second one. Yeah. It's a huge mistake they made it because they made the canine here, so they have to move to the distal area. Same things, I want to make the nice cusp height of contour which is I made it so this is kind of a little magic right and then always this cusp is higher than lingual cusp always big teeth opposite but the natural teeth no you must make the higher the huge cusp and engage it together which is the distal margin line okay and they engage together with the same cusp just like that actually dissection groove is was here like this if I draw it this is cusp it's not engaged together this is cusp and here's a cusp so then they can put together or cusp and engage together like that nice yeah. all right so this is the first premolar what I'm talking about I'm trying to add a little bit That was better. I'm trying to get slightly light contact, but here only contact, not linger. Talking about first premolar, they must understand. And just memorize it. So this is types, the first premolar, higher and lower. So here's non-function. If I'm saying class one. Okay, so do not worry about here is worry about bulk or cusp if it's class one. Right, so I'm trying to make the better cusp. We engage together. 
same thing so I'm gonna put a little bit more add it here now this is getting better the lingual contour for uh, tongue support and this so which is I'm trying to mimic with natural tools dissection group and secondary group as well see getting better so now you can add one more you can lower down the temperature if I cover too much then you just grinding like this then you can get another second or the low there making a secondary growth mm -hmm. like this but it's grinded I don't want to make the deep like that right so here is another cusp here and a little down so basically I made I made this die now is correction 2018 <laughs> yeah. 2018 this this model I made a 10 more than 13 years ago 15 I, I would say 15 years ago but now this is another concept we, we can always do better right Luke always 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 yeah yeah better now you don't see much but if I see the white you see the another white sorry yeah a bit better right you see okay mm. so almost done always first cusp is higher than second secondary group otherwise you get the interference from the secondary group so it depends on vice versa is it aesthetic or function I prefer function too see now it's done nice okay all right second one same things I make cusp Height of contour. Here is his highest point, which is second premolar, which is mandible, right? So I make a little bit, a little bit squarer than first premolar. See? Especially in the lingual. No, it's interproximal. Hmm. Interproximal, yeah. So I add it. Now you get the shape about the. The lower second premolar is like that. This is basic concept. So here's a cusp. Here's dissection. Here's dissection. Here's cusp, and you can make it move. Okay. So here you go. I add here. Still, I like the vocal contour. Still slightly higher than lower. Uh, here's the functional areas, which is the linger part. So now, once I set up the broad white contact, right. All right. So now I add a little bit more about the cusp. See. Too much, so I add it. Try to create the lingual contour and cusp. But this is engaged with the distal, about first smaller. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I'll be rounded. Yeah, slightly. You know, I don't like this too much. You see? Okay, so that one is the trying to make the contour. So as you can see, the here is more larger cusp than first premolar, mm -hmm. and here is more functional and marginal which is here. Then you can contact to the um, class one bite. More rectangular. Yeah. Okay.